Right, this is how to sew using a Swiss Army knife. And it's using the awl with the hole in it. Uh, I've heard this is essentially the same as using a sewing awl. I've not actually used a sewing awl, but I've done this before. So, a piece of thread or natural cordage or whatever, whatever you got. Stick it through the eye of your all. I suppose if you just do it like that, you can adjust this string in a minute. All right. Now, I'm going to stick this through. And then we're going to adjust the string slightly. It's quite tough this lever. Right. Now this bit, which is facing you, what you can see there, if you pull this slightly back it creates a loop what you can grab hold of. Now pull that so you're pulling so you're not pulling this side, but you're pulling this one out through here. That makes sense. And now we've got it coming through the top, underneath and down there and out there. Now all I would say now is just pull this one back a bit depending on how much you put through but at least having enough so it definitely runs a little bit further than what you're stitching now you want to pull this back through go over one a little bit and then put this back through again now it gets a bit more simpler after you've done the first one if you pull it back a little bit it creates a loop there. <coughs> and then this one, you get this and you stick it through your loop. And then you pull this one back again. You can pull them both tight if you want. And then you move over again pull it back a little bit and put this one back through there again Pull them tight. And then it's just the same thing. All the way along. So I'll zoom the camera in a bit more so you can see clearer. If you pull it back a little bit, see how it creates that, and then this one through it. And 
and hold it and pull it back and then you could tighten both of them. Now if you were stitching something what you wanted to look decent do this with whatever you're stitching on the inside turn it inside out and then do this rather than doing it this way but if you're just doing something like in a survival situation just to keep something together doesn't matter about doing it this way now you could now just tie it off like that and then essentially you've done your stitching with a Swiss army knife there may be a better way of finishing off like that if you stick it through or something you might be able to do it that way that's where I do it. So on that side, that's like that. It looks pretty decent. And that's how to sew with the awl of a Swiss Army knife. Cheers for watching. I'll see you later.